All right, uh, George, George, do I need to learn any programming languages in order to be a data analyst using Power BI, exception of SQL? So except SQL, except yes. Um, so uh, when we say programming languages, so when you say programming languages to me versus Patrick, we, we take it two different ways. Uh, when you're talking to me, I'm thinking C sharp, JavaScript, you know, Ruby. Ruby. Yeah, well, no, not VB. Don't do not do VB. Um, so uh, you don't need that. Um, the other thing that's interesting, if you, if you look you know, at, at things like Definitive Guide to DAX, so you should absolutely learn DAX and uh, M syntax for Power Query. Uh, but like one of the things I've, I've heard Marco say a lot is you DAX itself, if you come from that programming language, like real programming languages, he even says it in the beginning of the Definitive Guide to DAX of that that thought process of regular like c sharp or c plus plus or something like that it doesn't translate when you go to dax because it's a whole different thing so um you don't you don't need to have that experience so you can learn m syntax and dax and and be fine and if you know sql that's even better um but even sql is not necessarily required if you don't even have access to your database so yeah Yep. If if you if you talk programming language to me, we're talking about COBOL or Fortran. Uh, <laughs> wow, wow, oh boy, wow! I, see, and I thought you were going to go punch cards. That's what I thought you were going to do. Punch cards. Yeah, there you go. He's got his abacus ready. <laughs> COBOL. So, what now? COBOL? Yeah. Now, if if you're doing Power BI embedded, then you absolutely need to know some programming languages. Yeah. So whether it's C sharp or uh, you know something of that nature, so Python something, because um, then you have to write the application that embeds all that stuff. So that's a whole different whole different game. So uh, Laura, yes, yes, I am old enough. Actually, the first language I learned was in the eleventh grade on one of the, I forget the, one of the big, you know, green, that prints on the green paper, uh, we learned COBOL. Uh, yeah, 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 in high school. So, yeah. yeah wow, lots I of people reacting to that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> wow, wow. I will say the uh, first- Somebody did mention uh, Python and R. Python and R, but I don't know if those are com com considered programming. <sighs> well, Python languages. definitely is. I don't know. Python definitely yeah, Python is. is. Um, uh, R. Well, again, it's your, what's your definition of programming languages? The, yeah, I get so. The, the Python and R are interesting just from a data science perspective, and then you have those visuals inside of Power BI, which I'll, I will be honest, I don't know. I haven't heard. That doesn't come up a lot. Mm -hmm. So I think that's a very niche type thing. So, yeah. <laughs> Kelly, Kelly said, I was ready for Y2K. <laughs> yes, yes, I was. Yes. <laughs> I remember I was doing support when the Y2K thing happened. I was doing uh, Windows 95, 98 support, and uh, we were we were fully staffed at midnight for the Y2K thing. And they were all I remember is we were in the aisles of the call center, like playing football with like a Nerf football. Yeah. That was that was the whole time. And then they sent us home at like 1 a.m. It was like nothing. Yeah, yeah. That was a good time. 